Alright, welcome guys. So we are playing Randonautica tonight. We are taking a gamble doing this because I don't know what I'm about to get myself into. But we are heading to this park trying to see if we can generate a location. Uh, just It's a really bad area though I feel like because Randonautica will put you on private property and this is all but nothing but houses. But we're just going to try our luck with it. If we don't get anything inside this park we're going to, then we're going to switch areas. But, uh, I'm packing heat today. Packing some heat because Randonautica can be a bit scary sometimes. Uh, but, yeah, I'll see you guys later on. Okay, so my intent is right there at GBT. Pick a number. Decimal between 1 and 2. Intent. So the intent is sexy. Uh, let's try to close, close the location up a bit. Like I said, this area might be too nice for Randonautica. Okay, guys. So we just walked off some energy at this park. It, it's such an amazing park. But uh, we are getting just dead hits in this part of town. This is a lot of houses. So we are going to the Fort Apache Caves. Now, I'm kind of scared about doing this for two reasons. One, I almost got arrested there when it was at nighttime. And two, mountain lions and coyotes. But, I'm, uh, I don't even think an air, a CO2 gun would do shit against a uh, mountain lion, but we're gonna take our chances. Uh, we hear any sort of noise, we're gonna take off running back into the road. But we're, just, we're gonna park at the gas station we normally park at. We're gonna fire up Brandon. Not anything. Uh, we're gonna fire up Brandon Nautica and we're going to see if we can get anything around the Fort Apache Caves. This is gonna be really sketchy, I can tell you right now. Right now. Hello, oh, what's. Bro, what the fuck's happening? Let's go straight. Signatures or not. I think you're safe to get out. Oh. My fucking battery just went from 100% to 2%. Is there a ghost here? My battery just... It just fucking died. Here, let me try. All right, Mr. Ghost, I'm gonna start recording because this is potato quality. This is how you know it's good shit.
This could be significant. There's an arrow pointing this way. Pretty sure that's just a road marker. Oh my fucking god, I know what that means. So on one of CJ Faison's videos, he was in a forest and Random Nautica pointed into a part of the forest where there was a pink ribbon, the same type of pink as that. I don't think this is just an ordinary road marker. Because apparently pink ribbons in Rendonaka mean something. I say we follow this arrow, see if it leads us to anything over that way. I'm still worried about the five o'clock or anything, but sure. How's the camera doing? Is it still on 2%? Or is that just an armor? Uh, it's fucking dead. I can't turn it on. Watch out for snakes. Pretty sure that is a warehouse for the storing like construction materials for building roads. I'm curious that they haven't built one out here yet. Yeah, I say maybe that it could just be a road marker. Because like it, it took us, it wanted to take me literally in, right in front of that house, and that's what scares me. I guess cannibals. Car's fine. Well, I think I, I see something. It's cardboard right there. No, I see something. Like a bottle. That, that, that can't be it. Okay, no, there's something else. You, I think you're safe to get out. I have a computer that's constantly flaring in my mind that has nothing to do with what we're doing right now, other than the random Nautica thing. What? We're talking about CJ What's His Face's video, and something weird always happens in there every single time. You know what I'm saying? You know what? It's almost popping through my mind. What?
Well, it's not just CJ Face On isn't the only Randonautica channel. There's a lot of people that do it and they get like about the same stuff that CJ does. What the fuck is that? It looks like an open grave. Where? Ooh, let's go check it out. this is a very closed grave or this is just a pile of rocks well that's a very sus pile of rocks kind of heard something what I, there's this trail right here. I wonder, and the trail starts right in front of that house. I wonder if there's something on this trail. I heard someone talking. Hello? Hola. We no habla espanol. English? You know the bats flying. I think I see something further down there on the road. What? That what? that brush just fucking moved. What? That just moved. I'm gonna throw a rock at it. You threw a rock at it? No, I am going to throw a rock at it. Blink, motherfucker. Run. Move again. Did you hear that again? Someone talking. Yeah. It sounded like it came from that way. It sounded like it came from that way where my flashlight's pointing. Might be just an echo. This might just be grass. Huh? I said this might just be grass or something, just right here. Okay, looks, 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 looks. That rock, a rock just fucking. That was a rock. Or, or, someone just threw a rock at us. You know what? I'm thinking I'm moving the, mar uh, the car closer for this trail because. If we have to run back, like, either we jump through this tumbleweed field right here, or we go all the way back there, run to the car. Ah, I see people. Way over there next to the building. It is just echo. Oh. Yeah. But someone, I just, we just had a rock thrown at us, though. Because I fucking saw a rock move and hit that bush. Fuck is that? I think I see something.
It looks like it looks like um, plexiglass, but I don't really know if that means anything. I have to fucking know where where the hell that rock got thrown at us from. Move the car a bit closer. Yeah. Cause I want to grab my much brighter flashlight. What's the part of you? What do you think is happening here? Something up on the That's what I'm thinking. Hold on, could you imagine being out here? Just in the middle of nowhere with nobody but your family. <laughs> What, you think they practice what down here? Incest. Oh, probably. Fucking incest inbred. Inbred born. Got a gun. I'm trying to pull it up right in front of that house. <coughs> Big, bigger flashlight. That kind of looks like a person peeking over the edge to me. It's probably just like some sort of statue or bag, but still. And what about those spinny things that are kind of on rooftops sometimes? That is a balcony though. Uh, in 
far, like pull further past it. Go for five seconds. I mean, you might just fucking go all the way down, not all the way down, but a lot further down past the house. That bench is not creepy at all. That house is not creepy at all. Holy shit, I didn't see anybody moving in it. The lights were fucking on too, they shut off the lights. Here? I think maybe, yeah, I'll try here. This is not sketch like at all. You're not gonna use that as a spot. Here. Boy oh boy, the place is Randonautica takes us. Huh? I said boy oh boy, the places that Randonautica will take you. I say you shut up, we'll go lights out for right now. Try to get in front of that path I think and I think I see something. The fact that this house is creepy as it is, am I still filming? Yeah, the house is creepy as it is. And the fact that there's no sort of traffic on this road. Why do they have one of those child? Why do they have one of those kid things right out front for that? Usually there for traffic and kids playing. I feel like it's there because of the just kind of. I see what you're talking about. It does look like a person. I see what you're talking about, and it does look like a person. Yeah. Well, we're not on anyone's property, so... Let's see a few things that could be what we're looking for. More plexiglass. Yeah, there's plexiglass everywhere. Plastic. What's with all this plexiglass? No, this is plastic, Mike. That's just regular plastic? Uh, don't, don't shine your light towards the house. I think, to be honest with you, I think that this was a bust. Well, it's not abandoned. There's people there. Whoa, what's this? Oh, nothing. You know, if I didn't accidentally cancel the waypoint, it would, I would probably have a better idea where this geocache could be. But I'm just an idiot. What are you doing? Looking for reflectors. Like, maybe shiny equipment on people's clothes. 
That looks like a water treatment facility right over there. Mine goes farther. I can pretty, pretty much hit that little clip ridge that's over there. Also look for something that could be hanging from the bush. I said look for something that could also be hanging from a bush. fucking geocaching thing that's what we're doing tonight i don't fucking know what i'm doing here but i don't feel like i should be here it's a fucking creepy ass house and shit it's like what the fuck am i doing with my life all right we're doing bro Turn up, lights out, lights out. Look at that balcony in the dark part right behind the tree. Looks like there's either a candle or someone could be smoking a cigarette or something. Is it looks like a candle. Yeah, I don't got a good feeling about this shit. You want to get going? Where do you think the point of the two houses are? Because this looks like a lived-in house, but that house, I don't know. No, no, that house looks lived-in. That house looks very suspicious. You know what would be funny? What? This was such a great location to build a house that the uh, owners, like, it built this house. I just heard a rattle, the rattlesnake. Do you want to do another one? Sure, one. Okay. Still have some on Let's drive the fuck out of here. So I think this was a bus, but definitely heightened our senses. See you at the next one, guys. Okay, we're coming up on our next thing right here. It should be legit right on this fucking sidewalk. Right there. Somewhere. Yeah. Oh, there's a big ass fucking scorpion right there. That's a big boy. <sighs> I don't see anything of significance that would. I don't really see anything of significance that would show up on Render Nautica. There is a big ass fucking scorpion though. That might be it. 
That could be. That could be the wind of Nautica. It could be the scorpion. So uh, Anthem Hills Park. So put that in in your GPS. That's the place in Henderson where we will generate an evil intent. Guys, we just came across a military frequency on our radar. This is pretty insane. I don't know. <laughs> and then I, I, I come to find out, I go online, you know what I mean? I mean, it's not the, it's not the illegal channel. $17. Alright, we're heading to our last geocache of the night. That is Anthem Hills Park in Henderson. So we'll see you guys there. Alright guys, so we are out at Anthem Hills Park. Oh, listening to a military frequency on the radio. And uh, look at this beautiful view of Vegas. You know, the camera probably came in to capture it the way we can. Oh, they're, they're getting off. Looks like. And the case listing 73. Y'all have a wonderful night. All the best. Fuck. And uh, I always say God bless. And uh, WRTX 970 I'll, I'll get back in here tomorrow during the day, I think. A little bit yeah, they just come in here every night. 73. I should just say 24. Let's give it a second, though. What do you see? If anyone's messing with us, I got a firearm. Please come out. Come out if you don't want to get shot. Stop. I can't remember how to fucking use this thing. Fuck was that? What? Hello? I heard I heard him yell. Take your flashlight, give me mine. This is definitely fun. What do you want? Are there eyes? There's something there. What does it look like? I don't know, but it was moving. It was right behind that rock.
Alright, this is where it goes deeper in. That's, oh boy. Examine this area before we, huh? I said let's just make sure that everything's clear before we go deeper in. you well that wasn't you I got a gun fuck with me I'll fuck with you Here we go back. I forgot sh shit throwing locks out of us. <laughs> Sound like it came from like right over there that way. I have a strong feeling there's epidermis, there's epidermis out here. Because the one thing that they do is throw rocks. Something just fucking ran up on me. I just heard footsteps running up. Whoever's out here, you do not want to mess with us. Come out slowly. No, I didn't see anything. I heard it. I heard someone running up on me. Footsteps literally this fucking close to me. Quite possibly. We don't mean any disrespect. We just got scared. There are any spirits out here. Just know that. We're not here to damage your gravesite or anything like that. We're just exploring. Well, let's do a little bit of interaction. If you died out here, please give us a sign. Please give us a sign. Throw a rock or something. Just don't hit us. We're going to be leaving your territory now. We didn't mean to have any sort of permission to follow us anywhere. Understand? I have the power of Jesus Christ with me. You cannot hurt me. You cannot hurt Jared. We're leaving. We didn't mean to cause any disrespect to you. I don't feel comfortable turning my back to this area right here. No. I've never... Holy shit! I just...
just saw a shadow figure. Sure, it wasn't that. No, it wasn't that. It was right over there. You sure it was a it was a tall black figure. Well, it might be following us. What the fuck did I just say? Don't follow us. Bro, oh my fucking god. What? Oh my fucking god. Not that bird. I saw something all white run that way on all fours and then disappear. Of course, this is the... Alright, so this has been a crazy night. It was unbelievable. Between the Randonautica, the creepy house, to it being here, it was the scariest fucking thing I've ever experienced in my life. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Please be, feel free to give me a like, show your support by subscribing, and we'll see you again real soon. Take care. See you.